Hey guys, how are we doing? It's Carter here, and I've got a new source code for you today. This is a really exciting one. I'm, I think it's great. It's from Austin Church, and you guys might remember him from the Mustache Bash source code that's on my site. It's done, it's done well for a lot of people. I think that those of you who have both met Austin in person and via source code in the website, and just in general, I think that you'll notice that he produces really good stuff. He provides great customer support. He's also just a really smart guy, and I think that he he came to me with this new source code, and it had a really interesting value proposition, which I'm going to walk through in a few minutes. And what this what this app does so well is that it solves a really unique problem in the marketplace right now. Because I think a lot of us, you'll you'll open up any of these apps right now with different ad networks, and you'll see Candy Crush Saga everywhere, right? I mean, it's it's all over the place. They're buying traffic at everywhere they could possibly buy it, and they're spending a lot of money doing it. And so a lot of these ad networks are actually, like, they're being supported by games like Candy Crush Saga. And so if you can sell traffic to that game and convert it really well, you're going to do, you're going to make a lot of money. And so what Austin did is he created a game that does just that. He created a beautiful Match 3 style source code game. He built it for reskinning, and he built it with the idea that this game is such a, such a colossus in the marketplace that can support such big bids, that by having a source code that's going to sell relevant traffic to them, you're going to make a lot, a lot of money. And so what I want to do now is I'm going to walk through the app with you. It's called Viva Stampede. It's a beautiful app. I want to show you how the whole thing works, you know, what's going on in there. And then I want you to read the blog post and so you can see all the details and how much was put into this app and just how much value you guys are going to be getting when you buy the source code. So let's just pop this open right here. Uh, this style of game is called Match 3, and you'll see what I mean in a minute. So we pop open, and the first thing you see, this is Playhaven Interstitial. And that's going to pop open every time the app's opened. Uh, according to Austin, I think the ECPM is doing very well. I think it's in like five or six or, or higher than that dollars, and that's really good for um, you know just a, an opening interstitial marketplace bid. So I'm just gonna click no thanks, and then this is the opening screen, and you can hear in the background there's some music. This is custom music that Austin had produced for him. You can use stock music, you can use whatever you want. I think this this music's perfect for for the theme, and what you can see here. So we've got the play levels at the top. Below that are two different styles of gameplay, and I'm not going to go into these because you know we don't need to see the whole thing. But time mode just you know puts a clock on it. Endless mode allows you to play forever, and then we get the store free game now. How to play more? I'm going to go through all this, and then choose background. So what I want to do is I want to start with a how to play because that's going to be a tutorial. So someone might click how to play, and what you see is that it's a live tutorial, which is really cool because most times in tutorials it's just static images, right? And this is really nice because it, it walks through, people can see the actual physics, it really gives you a sense that this is a high quality game. So I'm gonna go through the next one and for a simple match, it, it talks to you through uh, you know, how to play the game, how to play the game well, how to enjoy it. And go to the next one, five simple match, same thing. And then it talks about the special symbols. And this is a great feature of the game because this is something that Candy Crush Saga does that a lot of match three games don't do. It's including bonuses, including uh, you know different pieces of the game that can actually enhance your gameplay. And what Austin did is he incorporated this in the development, and this makes a huge difference on the retention side of things because people really play to find these special symbols. That's that's what the game becomes, whether or not they they realize it or not. And then tokens. So there's a full store in here, which I'll walk through in a second. And the tokens are, you know, basically like coins in a slot machine game or anything where you can buy and redeem them for power-ups and, and anything else. And so it gets to the end of the tutorial and it goes to play now. So we're just going to go right into the game. I'll click play now. And you can see that this game pops open. It's just like a regular match three game. And so for anyone, if you, for some reason, have never played Candy Crush Saga or a match three, what you do is you click on two of the symbols and you match three of the same together. And now you can try to do four if you can find one. Um, but basically this is what happens and then you can see automatically if something lines up it'll automatically you know drop it down just like that and so this is how the game goes and you can see how the score at the top increases and you know you, you start playing this game and, and it's fun you know the, the physics are beautiful the graphics are great it's awesome at the bottom here he's got a, a banner that's mob clicks but it's also got um, a few other SDKs I think rev mob and chart boost are in there so it cascades so if if one network can't support the fill rate, it'll just go down to the next one, and, and that's really helpful. You see this red button right here? If you click that, um, it's a really clever way to do the remove ads button. And so what's gonna happen is this is gonna pop open, you know, do you wanna buy it? I'm gonna click cancel. I'll probably say something like this isn't gonna work. Yeah, but just click, you know, 
that's a remove ads button that's all built in that's perfectly placed and then it also shows you it has this little pop-up that shows you know if you're stuck you can how to redeem the power ups which is really cool and this gets this is almost like an upsell in a store right and so you click it and if you wanted to uh it automatically shows you the pop-up because so that you can you can get these power ups which is great that's basically the the screen that you have now if you go click on the cart this is the, what the store looks like where you actually instead of buying specific um, power-ups you're buying the tokens which will then redeem for power-ups which is, allows you to buy them over and over which is really really helpful and so we don't need to go through that but the hints chameleons and platypus trap like this he walks through what this all does this is really helpful when you're talking about adding value to the customer you know you can always do updates on this you can mess around with different price points and different different token sizes and things like that it's really really helpful so I go back and I'm gonna go to the back to the menu and what the menu has is we got like you know sound effects on and off music on and off um, I'm gonna turn the music off just so you guys can hear a little bit better uh, the free app if you click that it's gonna take you to uh, I think it's a rev mob I'm not gonna click it just because I don't want to go out of screen but that's gonna be tied into uh, some sort of upsell ad network and for now I'm just gonna go back to the main menu just so I can show you so go back to the main menu get the play him pop up again and we see here at the bottom we get the get the free game now that's the same deal over here on the right you've got to choose background which is another way to upsell people and these are all different themes that you can sell in the games and same thing if I click on this it's gonna be an in-app purchase it allows people to have you know different experiences with the game you can buy the uh, backgrounds pack which is gonna be a bunch of them uh, but just adds a, another way for to uh, to sell content to people, which is what you want to be doing. And then finally at the bottom here, we've got the the more button, which I'm going to click right here. And in the more button, we've got all these we got different things. And Austin did a great job with this, both in Mustache Bash and in Video Stampede, which is this game. Up top, you got the free app, which is going to be built into the SDK. Right on the app store, so you can get some positive ratings, top scores, which is uh, you know every time you play it, 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 it logs your top scores. How to play is that tutorial we walk through. More apps is going to be chart boost. Email support is going to pop open an email so that people can uh, send you questions or ideas or requests or whatever it may be. Tell a friend is the same deal. It's going to be a social way to, to spread the word. And then ad free version. This is the, the same pop up I showed you before where you click it and then it drops down. So I'm going to go back to the menu. <clears throat> and you can add to this, you can change it. You know, it's all easy to customize, everything's there. And so what we're, we're back to the home screen. And so everything here is really well built. It's all integrated. The, the code is really well laid out, so it's easy to reskin. And what you can do with this is you can create really highly targeted themes. And you can layer in different ad networks. You can test different ad networks to try to capitalize on Candy Crush Saga. Obviously, even if you're not selling straight to Candy Crush Saga, the, the theme of Match 3 right now is really, really popular. And people are going to be really interested in these time these style of games, especially when it's got high-end development like this. And so it's it's just like a really great source code to work with. It's it's It can make you a lot of money both on the in-app purchases but also on the ads. You can do a lot of different testing. You can work on a lot of different like direct deal type stuff, Ch check out different networks, te test different networks, see how games like Candy Crush Saga convert on this, which is gonna be at, out of the world. Like it's gonna, it's gonna completely crush it. And just overall, it, it's a really nice, uh, really nice framework to work with and to start with. If you want to get into Match 3, this is probably one of the best I've seen. And it's got a lot of different options to test and, and work with. So that's the, that's the long and short of it. I think you should, guys should all download the game, check it out, and then read through the blog post because there's a lot of details here that I, you know, I didn't get into specifically in the video but are definitely worth, worth checking out. And I hope this has been helpful. And read through the, the article. And if you have any questions, definitely leave a comment and we'll get back to you. All right, talk to you guys soon. Bye.